Hello and welcome back to more Let's Play the Juggernaut. Or Juggernaut, more like it. Um, in the previous episode, we went through the green door there. And figured out the two scenarios. Or at least the James Bond-like scenario again. Um, in this episode, we will be continuing on. With the other scenarios, if I can learn how to move again. And hopefully, uh, continue on with uh, the game. Now, what I've done here is uh, basically, I went ahead and I looked up what was wrong here. And we're actually missing something from the white room and it's not actually my fault that I've not figured it out yet this is actually a glitch from the game itself so th there was the white room that had everything turned around and upside down and crap and everything like that well we can't actually do anything in the room there because that is actually where the skeleton head and spike puzzle comes in at now, normally, you'd think with a puzzle that uh, you'd go ahead and click on an item to use, and then it would automatically work, or prompt you to ask if you want to do the puzzle. Well, in this case, it did not. And it's been a while since we've had to use the uh, body changers. Whoa, I forgot what it was doing for a moment. Um... But, you'd think that it would automatically prompt you. Well, in this case, it did not. Basically, what has happened is, in order to switch the room around, you have to move the skulls in that hallway, and you have to move each of them three times. Um, the problem with that is, is that it does not prompt you to rotate the skulls at all until... Uh, you've clicked on the skulls, I believe, three times. And then it will prompt you to rotate it. And then we'll have to rotate it to the way that the book showed. Which I remember, so... Lucky me. Because I've actually been thinking about it. And I was like, when is this ever going to be useful, you know? But I was right, at least, in saying that the white room was related to that picture. So I was good at guessing, at least. And we're gonna keep going down this way. I also found out that we do need to go ahead and look for more objects from our past. Uh, I don't know what... I know what one of the objects is. But I heard that there are... Or I saw that there are three of them. I know what two of them are. I'm not sure what the last one is. So, what we want to do, we're going to switch to the adult body, actually. Apart from the juvenile body. We'll turn around. We need to go into the adult body so that we can rotate those skulls. So, we'll go over here. Go into the adult body. Yep. We'll go over here. And go through this door. Alright. And I don't know exactly which skull is for which part. But I know we need to click it like three times. Skull seems to... Do you want to rotate the skull? Okay. Don't know exactly what that does. That. One moment. I think I know what this does. 
Let me grab my journal, it's over here. I'm gonna have to take the heads up. Real quick. Okay, so let's actually see what's happened to the room so far. Small, don't press the button, right? Aha! So it did rotate the room. So... Let's go ahead and rotate you once. Alright, so he's looking that way. I think that hint is just to show us... Enter... Can we enter it now? No, we can't. Okay. Basically, it's like working with a cube, only you have to go to two sections to actually view the cube. I'm gonna guess this is also gonna be a wall. Yes, it would be. Okay. I think I know where we're at here. Yes. That didn't sound good. Oh, hello. We got the dining room table. What is important about this dining room table? There's something important about it? Well, are we just gonna, like, look around? Okay, we walked around the table. Good job, guys. We, we got this room just to walk around a table. Right, so I'm leaving. Right, so that gave us a dining room table. Let's go ahead and rotate this skull. Now what did that do? Enter. It's a wall again. go ahead and press the button. I believe what I read was if I press the button, the room returns to normal. Right. So that should be a door and we'll be... Let's go ahead and take a look at what's inside. So there's a desk right above us, if I remember right. So we have a door there and a door there. So, if the skull is looking this way, that means if we turn the skull right, the door should be right below us. If I turn it that way, This is actually kind of confusing. So if I turned it that way... There'd be a blank space there. Wait a second. Okay, I'm looking at this drawing. We turned it that way, the whole cube would rotate 
right. Okay. I want to move this once. Uh, that actually... That leads to a wall. I don't get that. The whole cube rotated, that means there should be a door according to the drawing. thinking it will prompt us every single time that we find a solution, to be honest. Yes. So, that's gonna be a wall. Okay. So we've spun it all the way around, right? So there's none on that section. Let's go ahead and we'll rotate it this way again. So now the skull's upside down. Right, and so that would give us a blank wall. Because it's upside down. So if we turned it Okay. That should be a wall. Okay. If I turned it again. Right. That should be a wall. Right. If I turn it again. Enter. Wall. Okay. back to normal, so that's going to also be a wall. Because we already checked that one. Okay. So there's none on that section. We'll turn it again. Okay. Enter. That should be a wall. This is the weirdest puzzle I've ever seen. I'll turn you. And I think that should give us the dining room table. Again. Right, yes, that gives us the dining room table. I'm almost wanting to say, let's go into child form and see if there's something around this table. Let's try that. I'm going to go into child form. And see if anything changes. From his point of view. Do 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 Okay. We'll go over here. It would suck if it resets. I hope it doesn't. I, I don't think it would. No, I think we're fine. Okay. And we'll go over here. 
Can we open? Yeah, we can. There's this. There's a juvenile door over here. We should be fine. No, we don't want to press the button. What is on in here? Oh, oh. There's film under the table. Uh. Case has a letter P on it. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Alright. I don't imagine that's everything that we came here for, though. Let's think. It might be, actually. Regardless, we've gotten something, so... I'm gonna go ahead and count that as good. And we're gonna head back over... I think we actually still need the juvenile body here. We're gonna go back over to the other section. And put the P film in. Which means we need to go downstairs. Do 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 Blue do 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 I hope there's nothing else in those skull rooms. We never went through an There's gonna be three different ways through that. I don't know what they are now. But I, there are three doors and I'm guessing you have to rotate it for each one of those doors. We found one of the doors twice now. And it's when the skulls are where they are in their current position. So... I'll mark down what their current position is when we get back there. And see how that affects the cube that I've drawn. And I'll try and like rotate the cube like it is drawn on my paper. And see if there's like a direct correlation between them. Alright, so we need to go into adult form. Apart from the juvenile body. And we need to go into the adult body. Do 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 do. In here. We'll get the adult body. We'll turn around. Go through this door. Go through this door. So what's the point of the last bit of film now that I think about it? Is it really just a fake? You can feel a warm color coming out. Because now we have P film, so and there's only four containers. I guess that's why we'd be able to take it out. I guess if you put the real one in, then it locks, like the ones that did lock. Is this the film room? No, it's not, I believe. Oh, it is, okay. And now this one should... We should be able to watch the film all the way through. Nice. It's film. Film B. Use. And that should lock now. Yes, the box is locked. So I'm guessing that film is just, like, to confuse you. As if the game needed to confuse us any more than it already does. Let's play the film. Here we go.
Oh, it goes to the right door. Change to Juggernaut Disc 2. Alright, I guess we'll start our third, I'm going to assume, beach or island scenario in the next episode. So, I will see you all then.